Blacks cannot be citizens of the United States. In a sense, Dred Scott can't even sue because he's not an American. This is this is one of the best examples of this notion of blacks as aliens. Even though he's born here and everything, he is not an American. The American family, as Tony says, is for white people. And in the most famous sentence in that decision, he says, a black man has no rights which a white man is bound to respect. Now, he's not saying blacks can be killed with impunity. What he's saying is, legally speaking, they are not part of the body politic. They are not part of the we, the people, that created the Constitution. And therefore, they're just outside of the system. So they, they don't have any rights. That Dred Scott case is really trying to indicate that our people, when they say your people don't have any rights that a white man is bound to respect, they're, it's, what they're doing is demonstrating the power that they had over your people. That's what they're doing, and he's speaking to that power and the fact that they were demonstrating that power over your people for, for a couple of centuries. So that means in the state of Georgia, where I, where I currently reside, that I should be able to pull up the driver's license, something about the driver's license and probate. You reside right? now? You're a resident, right? Yep, that's a fact. That's a fact. Not a citizen. Yeah, of course I'm a citizen. No, you're a resident. You said it right the first time. I'm yeah, a I'm a resident. resident. Then you can stop thing, two brother. things can be two things can be true at the same time. Stop it. No, they cannot. The no, they cannot. Man, that's no, they cannot. The Fourteenth Amendment created a new class of citizenship in the United States, a second class citizenship. Up until 1868, every American was a paramount citizen of their state, and by virtue of that also a citizen of the United States, with full individual sovereignty as guaranteed by Amendments 9 and 10 in the Bill of Rights. And why are you still here? This is not your country. You can't this say this country. is your country. This is not your country. country. This is your country. This is not your country. No, it's not. It's your country. You're a foreigner. You're a foreigner. Okay, so what? Okay, wait. Serious question. It's not, it's not your country. So what have you done? What have you done? I can show you in the Law of Nations. It's called a subclass citizen that doesn't have all the rights of the people there. And that's what's happened. They created a corporation, and through residency, through the zip code, through your own signature, your own mark, your own penmanship, you've given up your God-given unalienable rights to be free, self-governed children of the Most High God. You're a resident, right? Yep, that's a fact. That's a fact. Not a citizen. Noble Drew Ali was a man, and he was incorrect. Historically.